Welcome to the video series, The Slit Lamp Exam. This video explains the use of diffuse illumination in the slit lamp exam. It covers the following topics. Illumination principle, usage, specific advantages, slit lamp setup, how to apply the technique, and limitations of the technique. Illumination principle. Diffuse illumination is a technique which illuminates the observed field homogeneously. Diffuse illumination can be created either by engaging the diffuser or with a dedicated background illumination. Usage. It is mainly used to achieve an evenly illuminated overview of the anterior segment and external eye. This is for example useful for assessing bulbar hyperemia or for providing even illumination if you want to measure dimensions with a dedicated measuring ocular. Furthermore, it is used in slit lamp imaging where the additional diffuse background illumination provides relevant clinical information to the still image. For comparison, here the same image without diffuse background illumination. Specific advantages. The specific advantage of diffuse illumination is that it provides a uniform light distribution which gives you an overview of a wide field. In comparison, the same eye but illuminated with direct focal illumination. Slit lamp setup. To set up the slit lamp, choose a moderate light intensity, bring the diffuser in position and open the slit completely. Alternatively, you can switch on a dedicated background illumination. Select an illumination angle somewhere around 30 degrees for ensuring even illumination. We recommend a magnification of 6 times or 10 times. How to apply the technique? Examining with diffuse illumination is relatively straightforward. Because you are working with low magnification and thus the deep depth of field and the widely illuminated area makes the focus less critical. Limitations. While diffuse illumination is useful for providing an overview, it is unsuitable for detecting subtle changes in semi-transparent tissues. In this image, for example, you do not see any defect in the corneal epithelium. But when illuminating with focal illumination, it becomes immediately visible. Thank you for watching. The Hogstrite team wishes you a lot of success in using this illumination technique. This episode was made possible with the following contributions.